What's going on guys, everything out before we begin today, I'm going to be showing you how, how to get a, um, in furnace in GTA 5. So, um, if you're on Michael, which you have to be on, well you don't have to be, but you have to know where his house is. Um, and you know, we, no you don't have to know where his house is, you have to know where that little clothing shop is. So that, that little clothing shop right there, well these cars, they will spawn exactly where I just got this one. See, it, it spawned right there. So, yeah guys, that's how you get an furnace in GTA 5. Uh, it's really, really cool. And so you don't have to go out and buy one because they're the fastest cars in the game. And I have one at home for like keeping. Well, I'm not ever going to let it go, but if you, um, you can't, you can get a lot more than one. They'll just spawn here. So, uh, and they're not, they might not always spawn, and I'm playing on Xbox, as always. And, yeah, guys, um, this thing has incredible speed, and I am playing as Michael, and I have Frank on with me. I haven't played GTA 5 in a pretty good while. Oh, there's another one. Huh? Yeah, they spawn right there, too. They spawn all around. I mean, they don't just spawn right there, but that's where they always are. So, yeah, I want to get up to maximum speed if I can. Alright. Uh, Let's try this. I'm pouring it. Look at the speed. If I had Franklin, this would be a whole lot easier. But yeah, guys, you see how that is. It's awesome to just drive it in general. It's awesome. So yeah. I don't know how I'm going to spell in furnace on this whenever I name this video, but uh, I'll just look off of GTA 5. But uh, yeah, guys, you can you can see that's an inferno. So you want me to just take it? Oh, sorry. Inferno. You can look them up. You can look them up online. Um, and tell me that's not what they look like. Look how cool the doors look like too. Look at that. I wish the back could come off of it, but it can't. I think it can on some models, but not this model. Yeah, um, this is basically, um, how the car goes out, and, um, yeah, so we'll just drive around for a second, because this video is very short, I don't want it to be that short, I've had one of these, but, um, that's whenever I first started GTA 5, and I was kind of like an idiot, and I had no idea what it was, ah, yeah guys, don't, don't say I'm torturing this car, because I'm not, I already have one back at home. Well, I am torching the car. I just I'm not worried about it because I have one at home. Um, and there's normally good cars in this parking lot. If you did not know that, if you're like new at GTA 5, that should help you a little bit. That's a pretty nice car back there. And um, yeah, so there's nice cars in here. I'm sorry if it's getting a little dark in GTA. It does that. It's always dark in GTA 5. Oh look, a tractor. Oh, cool. It's not moving. I'm not going to get it, though, because this is way better than the tractor. It's way faster. It'll come up bigger hills. And, guys, I will be doing a GTA 5 Easter egg. And if you don't know what an, what an Easter egg is, sorry about that banging. It's my nanny. And, um, 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 I'm sorry. If you don't know what an Easter egg is, it's kind of like a, like a, like a glitch. Or, well, it's not really a glitch. It's just something that's really awesome in the game so yeah um so this is basically what an furnace looks like it's it's torn half to death but that's okay everything will be okay oh we have a lifeguard truck right there i like running on the beach because you can knock people off their four wheelers like that and there's normally a lot of people on the beach but today there's not and guys if you did not know this I'll show you how to get a monster truck well, it's not really like that big but just pretty big okay so you just uh, go under here out okay okay you just go through here and uh, you'll see that big truck right there I'm gonna jump over it there's a jump right next to it which I'm gonna do I'm gonna get some speed back
Okay. So yeah, I'm playing on the Xbox 360, as you can see right there. Let's go ahead and jump. It's going to be awesome. Oh, yeah. Oh. Ow, ow. At least I jumped over it. And yeah, you can get jet skis and stuff here, too. can't believe Franklin's still alive. So, uh, yeah, there's the big truck. Come on, let me get out. I'm gonna get out of that car and get in the big truck. Actually, no, I just want to show you guys. So, yeah, that's what that's what it looks like. It is, in fact, a Ford, I think. I don't know. Sorry, Franklin. Um, uh, uh, guys, so I'm not going to end the video here. I like to do at least a nine-minute video, so, yeah. I like to run over people on the beach. It's kind of fun. Go, 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 go. Don't do that in real life. Woohoo. All right, I'm going to go back to the parking lot, which I have no idea where it is. And, guys, I know most of you know how to do this, but if you don't, come here. I want to show you how to control a bike. I'm just showing you random like things about, about the game. So this is how you do it. You just, you press A. That's how you pedal. Or you can just hold it or press it. I like to press it because it makes you go faster. Can Franklin, does he like follow me or? Yeah, he follows me. But yeah guys, I'm probably gonna end this video here. Hope you enjoyed this video. Peace out.